What's up guys, Sand7 here, and I've got a second scouting report for you on Lick. The first one, he had all five heroes running down low. It turned into a DPS contest that I won, and I was dealing with a 3 of 5 revitalized champ on the bottom. Heroes roughly around 93. I believe he's probably leveled up, probably got one 6 star, and he's probably going to be running two lanes. So... Hopefully I can pick the right lane this time, and it'll be a, another one, one challenge win to get into the top 25. Alright, I, nah, I think I'm going to flip that. I've been really liking the combination of the ninja exploding with the spirit mage. Because ninja goes boom, and spirit mage cleans up with revitalize. And I believe Thunder God's going to be making some more appearances after getting his five stars that's not a good lane choice I, i'm gonna get crushed here you champ stun me it's over now let's see i believe i saw that succubus running i couldn't i didn't look didn't watch it closely enough to see if it was a four or five or five of five so we're gonna re-challenge here and i'm definitely going to send paladin and spirit mage up top and my DPS in the middle. And when I say DPS guys, that means damage per second. And really, what I want out of that is just to literally just thump that shrine. My best combo are those three right there in the middle. Because Druid throws that energetic, grabs that 25% bonus. And here up top, let's see how we do. Paladin's gonna tank for me like a man. And there's the proc from Spirit Mage with that revitalize. And we got both of them. All right. Now it's over. Um, with my three guys there, Spirit Mage generally doesn't have time to get to the shrine. And that's why I don't like to pair my Succubus and Ninja, because the only time I pair them is when I know the setup or I have a very, very good read on it. All right, guys, um, that's Lick. And I just made it back to the top 25 for the first time in a while. It's just been one of those days. I've made some good moves. I've had some luck. And it's been quiet, really. I haven't been getting challenged very often. It's nice. I hope to stay here, but I don't think it's going to last too long. My heroes are a bit underleveled. All right, guys, that's it for now. Sand7 out.